Hello friends, it's Christy. Welcome to Bitly Daily House Plans. In today's video, we are unboxing the last, the final Erin Condren seasonal surprise box. So let's take a peek. Alrighty friends, so this box, as Erin Condren has mentioned, and I'm sure you all know, maybe you've all seen a bunch of other unboxings, and you just wanted to tune in for my take on this. Uh, this is the last one. I believe they're replacing it with something else. I'm wondering if they'll replace it with like a subscription. I don't know, I wonder. Anyways, they said that this was the last. It is the summer box for 2023. It's got the Bird of Paradise on here, very tropical summery theme. It's really a pretty box. I did use some undo uh, just to take my shipping label off. I didn't order any uh, any large extra things to have it come inside a box. So it is what it is, but these boxes are reversible. You'll see when I open the lid, let's go ahead and open it up. There's a quote here. It says, you are right where you need to be. It's got this beautiful sort of ombre effect. I think this was what they called their color blends. So it kind of starts out really orangey up here at the top and then goes more into sort of like a, a pink here. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna open up the tissue and the bubble wrap here. We've got a note card here. It says, you are right where you need to be. The final seasonal surprise box. This may be the final surprise box, but it's not the final surprise. Stay tuned for an all new exclusive and limited edition way to get your essential, or no, sorry, to get your seasonal fix. So yeah, I'm, I'm wondering if they'll go to more of a subscription model, who knows? So it says, make sure you tag us on social. And then over here, it'll tell us all about the items that are in the box, so we'll go through all of that. And then here we have just sort of a little note card of some back to school collection things that are going on. Let's see, I'm gonna flip this open. This is all about the lifestyle planner, the paper layouts, highly customizable, made in the US, some quotes here from some of their staff. So that's that. Okay, so let's, I'm gonna pull everything out and then we'll go through it all one by one. Okay, so let's start with this washi here. It says washi tape, sticker roll duo, half circle stickers. So these are circle stickers. Okay, let me pop this open. Okay, so we'll start with this larger one here. There's a little arrow here. Okay, so I finally got this open here. This is kind of strange. It's got this tape here. I'm gonna take that off. Okay, so this is just a roll of circles. Let me get a little notebook out here. This is just my Archer and Olive trial notebook. I kind of do swatches and pen tests in here, so let's see. Okay, so these are just kind of like, maybe a little bit bigger than a half inch circle, different colors. They're all kind of just stuck on top of each other though. It's a little, they're really sticky, so they're not gonna go anywhere once you put them down, but they are a little hard to kind of get separated here. I just kind of want to show you a couple more of the colors. So here's kind of a pinky color. And again, another like orange color. So these are full circles. Let's see if they're removable. Let's see if this, yeah, you, you can remove them and reposition them. And then this one here is a smaller roll. Let's see if I can get this one open. Okay, so let's see, this is like a half circle. Oh, it's kind of ombre in color too. It's a lot bigger than these circles. Let's see, let's see if I can get another one to come up. Ooh, this one's pretty. That one's really pretty. It's got that color blend effect. So we've got full circles and half circles. I'll bring it up closer so you can kind of see. Those are interesting. They're kind of, you kind of got to wrestle with them a little bit though, friends. Just going to be honest there. I don't know. They're kind of pretty though. Okay, so that's the first thing. 
And then this here, let's see. Oh, let me pull the little card. Let's see. Number five, washi tape duo. That's an exclusive valued at $8.50. Okay, so then that means that it won't be available later on their website if it's an exclusive. Okay, so then this here, number three, this is the seven by nine coiled notebook with special interior, exclusive, again, 2250 is the value on this. And I believe you got to choose your cover and I chose the Bird of Paradise one and there was another one that I think had like a sun on it. So let's see, it says take note. So this is a little different from current notebooks. So like, here's another cover where it just has lines on the inside. This one has more of like a dashboard look take note, do the right thing. So here's your page where you can put your name. Oh, I like this. So just lines, very nice, clean and simple, but you see the months of the year in sort of that color blend effect. And then the days of the month. So you could circle, this is June 12th or what's today? The 11th. <laughs> you could circle June 11th and you could write your notes for that particular day. And then let's see, I feel like it's the same color blend it's not like changing or anything like that and this line here is the same as we go through it yeah and it's the nice Erin Condren paper of course it doesn't look like the pages are perforated so I don't think they're perforated but of course the covers are removable so here's just kind of the back let's just see yeah the last page is just sort of that same color blend effect and then here is inside of the back cover, just lines, top to bottom, and then the back is the same as the front. Of course, these covers are removable, as you can see there. So that's a nice notebook. I like that. You can kind of journal with it with it, having the dates across the top there and, and kind of self-date it. Okay, so that's that. And then next we have here Snap-in functional planning stencil. I love stencils. You know I use my Erin Condren stencil a lot. Let's see, snap-in, this is number one. It says it's also an exclusive. It's valued at $8, so this is the planner stencil. So let's take a look. Okay, so snaps in, so you've got the coil here. We've got some circles, like maybe checklists, and then lines, so if you had perhaps the vertical, the traditional one without the lines, this could help you with putting in lines. You've got, looks like a quarter box. You've got a box here with rounded on the bottom, and then you've kind of got this arched box here, a nice square box, and then it looks like, look at, you've got probably like a two hour, one hour, like you've got all the different size boxes that you could ever want. And then a bunch of hearts, circles of different sizes, and then squares of different sizes. And then you've got a nice little circle grid here, which kind of reminds me of, I'm gonna put this, let's see, yeah. Maybe you can see it better that way. This kind of reminds me of my stencil from Erin Condren that has the little squares, except for this is a little circle, so I kind of like that. So you can see everything. And then let's see, let's pull this notebook back. So you could just snap this right here on the coil like this, etc. Okay, that's really nice. I like the stencil, that's cool. Okay, so let's see, what's next? What do we have here? Ooh, this is pretty. Notepad and sticky note set. It says five sticky notepads times 50 sheets, one notepad times 40 sheets. Okay, let's open this up. The color blend on the back here is really pretty and I like sort of the little gold foiled stars there. Okay, oh, okay, perfect. So you've got here today, today's top three, and then you've got a space here to put the date. And then these are the five little sticky notes you've got here, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, etc. days of the week. Ooh, these are pretty sticky too, like all the way, more than halfway down. If you can see, the stickiness comes all the way down here, so that's not gonna go anywhere. Let's bring back this notebook so you can kind of see. Yeah, see how nice and sticky that is? And then you've got 
some of that ombre color blend of like little page flags. I use these a lot in the office. So that's really nice. These here are not sticky, but you could just tear off a page for your day. So let's take a look and see what the note card says about this. So this is number six. It says notepad and sticky note set. It's an exclusive and it's valued at $18.50. So there you go. This is nice. I like that. That's pretty. I like the page flags. Those are really come in handy. Okay, so there's that. And then let's see. We've always gotten stickers. So I think these are the stickers. Let's take a look at these. Okay, so there's definitely two sheets here and you've got that same color blend effect, really pretty with gold foiling. Rest is productive, a bunch of quotes here. Good days ahead, hello summer, summer love, you are right where you need to be, which is the theme of the box. Create your own sunshine, good vibes only, let yourself be perfectly imperfect. So some of these are like, like this one's like kind of scalloped in a little circle here. And then this one's just a perfect circle and then this one's kind of cut around the quote and you've got a bunch of Bird of Paradise stickers. I feel like this is sort of that washi paper. Yeah, these are really thin like washi paper stickers. And then let's see here, you've got some functional things here. A bunch of little dots here, days of the week. You've got here like a whole little checklist. This here, see that little checked pattern? I bet you could make like a month box out of this. Another checklist here, just kind of a full box type situation. Let's feel this paper. This is a little thicker than these. So it feels more like a, a regular type sticker. So let's see what the card says on these. Number four, sticker sheet duo with foil. Exclusive at 650 is the value on this. So these are pretty. These could be used like in your journal. That's pretty, I like that. These are also very pretty. I like the gold foiling and this ombre color blend effect. I don't really use a ton of her stickers, but these ones are cute. I like this. I like the little quotes. Okay, so there's the stickers. And then last but not least, this is retractable fine liner six pack. Let's see, what does this say? Number two, it's an exclusive. For, so everything in here is exclusive. 1650 is the value on this. Yeah, Pastel Sun was the other cover that you could have chosen and I did Birds of Paradise. So let's open up this pack of pens. So the colors are seafoam, teal, cornflower, salmon, amethyst, and raspberry. Take these out and then I'm gonna bring back my book here. Okay, so the barrel on these is just a nice white. There's no rubber grippy, but there's like these little grooves here. Does it say the color on the pen? I don't see the color on the pen, just on the back of the packaging there. So let's see. Oh, I see, this is like a little tip. I was like, what is this? So there's just like little black piece protecting the tip. I wonder if I have to put that back on. No, I don't think I do, but I guess if I wanted to keep it nice and, let's see, I'm looking for the, okay, so this should be the sea foam. So let's see. I wouldn't call these really fine line. I mean, it's a marker. It's got definitely got a marker tip, but I wouldn't necessarily call that a fine tip. Okay, so then teal is next. So again, we'll take this little, I'm gonna save these because I think it'll help keep the pen like from drying out. Teal, that's a pretty color, I like that. And then we've got cornflower. Oh, this is, I'm excited about this because I love this color. Isn't it pretty? Oh, I like this one. Cornflower, I'm gonna, oh, that's pretty for sure. Okay, and then next is salmon. They write nice, but like I said, they're kind of thick to me. I don't view these as a fine liner, which is fine. 
And then this is amethyst. Pretty. And then this one's raspberry. You can hear the noise. Cute, let me go back and do a little color. Oops, swatch of each of these here that I didn't do in the beginning. Oh, I like these colors for sure. I like these a lot. I think this is probably one of my favorite pens so far. I like that. Cool, okay, so that's it from the box. And then friends, I did order a couple of just little extras. So I loved this cover. This is an Eta V co cover. I put Get It Done on there. So I'll use this on my A5 notebook at work. Isn't it gorgeous? So then here's the inside. It has that dashboard and then just lines very similar to the notebook we got in the box. So just the same on both. Little bit of this uh, kind of gold, maybe rose gold or coppery foiling in it. And then the quote there that I put has foiling. This is so pretty, I love this. Okay, so there's that. This was extra that I bought. And then this other, also an Etta v. I just love her stuff. This, I think it was called the Bold Blooms. Oh, and it has, ooh, look at this green on the inside. It's like that seafoam on the pen. This is really pretty. So again, that new dashboard kind of layout and then just lines on the back. I did not customize this cover because I didn't want anything on here. I just wanted the pretty flowers. So again, I can use these on my A5 notebooks that I use at work. So let me bring everything back in. Alrighty friends, so this is one last look of everything in the box. So the pens, the notebook, the two sheets of stickers, the stencil, the two rolls of washi tape, the little notepad here, and then these two covers that I purchased and added myself. Uh, so that's it. They say this is the final seasonal surprise box, but that something else is to come, so we'll see what happens. All right, friends, leave comments below on what you think of this box. Do you feel like it was worth it? In some ways, there so there isn't anything lifestyle in here. It's all very planner focused and related, which I'm fine with that. I really like that. I just wonder, like, I don't know if I feel like it's the same amount of stuff that we've gotten in boxes past. Like, well, I will say I do like the majority of things in here and there have been boxes where there were things I didn't like. I love the pens, always love the notebook. I love this. This is either gonna be a great gift or a tool that I'll use. I love the stencil, I'll definitely use that. The stickers, I kinda, like I said, I don't really use a lot of their stickers. These I might use, I don't know, but for the rest of it, I'm really happy with it. But let me know what you think. All right, friends, that's it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe so you can catch future content on my channel. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.